Hi friends, welcome back to another episode of Isle of Murphy. I know it's been a while, but I have been busy with life and boring stuff that um, is not haul related. Um, I wanted to show you guys this because I found the cup. This is not the cup of all cups, but it is Murphy's cup. I found this at Walgreens a long time ago and took a little selfie with it. And if you guys have paid attention, it's like the little, well, the only really, really the only picture that I have um, of myself. Um, I was so excited to find it again that um, I bought it. Don't really know what I'm gonna do with it, but um, it's a gigantic cup and it says, all, or hail to the queen, which I like it. I don't know what else to say, but I am I'm beside myself with excitement. I think I'm going to replace the box that I use to fill things up to determine how many items I will um, unbag or unbox in my hauls and use this. So I have a bunch of stuff today from Joom actually um, that I'm going to put in here. Hopefully they'll fit because I really want to unbox a bunch of stuff and hopefully my intro is not too long. I don't know if all of this is going to fit. We'll make it work. I think this is a good idea, so let's see. Um, hold on while I try. So we can do this. Technically it does, maybe? Let's see. Ah, it is nice, I like it. Um, it's like a bouquet, a wish k, a June k. That's a new word. Sorry guys. Um, we will include them because they did originally fit. Um, I have to get my scissors, so give me one sec. And we're back. So thanks for waiting, and uh, sorry for the wacky intro. I have been planning this video for a while. Um, this is all the stuff that's been coming that doesn't have Wish on the label. So if you can see, it's just like China Post or something on some of them. Although I have to say that I had opened up a couple of things that said wish on the packaging um only to you know be really 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 sure that i did not order them from the wish so we'll see um this actually this is cute i actually ordered this as a scarf um i thought it looked a little bit different um i ordered this actually for my daughter's teacher it's a bunch of owls you know, owls are synonymous with knowledge. Here at the state side, I'm not really sure. I'm pretty sure that's kind of everywhere, but I like it. It's pretty, oh, it's very soft. And hopefully it's not tri triangular like all the other weird ones that I had gotten. It looks to be just a regular scarf. It is, oh, it's doubled up. Okay, I was a little worried. It's a really long... Oh, it's an eternity scarf. Okay, so it's an eternity scarf. So it doesn't. Um, let's let's try it, shall we? I mean, it's cute. I like it. I don't give a hoot. I'm being really dumb. Sorry. Like I said, I'm very excited about this um, haul just because I wanted to have a distraction from all the hecticness, is that a thing, is that a word, of all the uh, stuff going on at home with uh, my dad being sick and being just, just bombarded with stuff to do and it's hard. I don't wish this upon anyone and um, hopefully he gets better and uh, hopefully everybody that has an alien loved one, or is alien themselves gets better. Cancer sucks, what can I say? Um, but yeah, I've been meaning to come back online. I just, you know, things happen, and I hope you guys understand that. I hope you guys miss me as much as I miss you. Um, these are actually perfect, and I'm glad I, I was smart not to wear earrings today. Uh, you will see that I have my little thingy on. Oh, that hurt, okay. Um, my bracelet is MIA. Uh, last time I saw it, it was in the hands of a toddler, so I might have to order myself another bracelet or bangle that holds the elastics because my parents were right. It does leave a mark. Anyway, back to the stuff I actually bought. So these are really pretty. I got these in a couple of different styles. I don't know if you can really see them very well, 
They are just earrings. They're little dome earrings. Not, you know, super fancy or anything, but they're kind of fun and playful. And they have like almost like an antique gold or bronze, brass, antique brass uh, finish. They are, um, they kind of look like this. High focus would be great. They kind of look like the sky to me. And there were several options. So I chose these and several others because you know how I roll. When there are two colors or four, I did not buy every single one. I did put almost all of them in my cart. I'm not going to lie. But I did not get them all. I ended up editing. So editing is good. We're going to try to edit. But for a couple of dollars, I always feel like... Not that you can really see anything but my giant sky right there. Um, they're kind of cute. They're not too... They're just fun for every day. Me like it. All right, moving on. Because we have a lot of... We have a jug full of stuff that we need to go through. And I have a bucket uh, more, a basket more of things. So I'm going to try to be a little bit more consistent. My original plan was to make a video for you guys every day. Oh. Um, every day while I was on spring break. Um, and so far, today is officially my first day of spring break from school. But, um, you know, leading into it, I could have done something more and... I'm sorry that I didn't. Um, these are actually, I got one in black and brown because I wasn't sure what the, my hair color would look like. They are hair elastics for ponytails and they have like faux fake hair, which I don't know if it's really a big deal, but sometimes people um, have this thing about like when you're dressing up or something because you know I'm so fancy that they don't want the elastics to show or if it's like a weird color so they want it to look like hair. Not that this actually looks like hair, because whose hair is this shiny? Right? I mean, I don't know. They have... I know my hair looks terrible, so... You know? I don't know why I try. Okay, I'm just gonna... We'll just leave that one where it is. So that one was a brown. This is black. It's got a little bobble on the end, like two beads, one on each side. And then it's got this... I can't even, I can't. I got this here, the faux hairs. It's cute, it's got a very elastic -y. I'm sure I'll get um, some use out of these. Neither one really matches my hair color, so I don't know about that, but it's a good idea. Ooh, this may, might be makeup. So I did buy, this is square, very square. Yep, it's a ColourPop shadow. ColourPop shadow. This is a pretty one, it's another Super Shock. Oh, it's jiggly. Um, it's pretty. It's called, what is this called? Slave to Pink. I find that appropriate. This is pretty. I ordered a few of them. And when I felt this one, when I pulled it out of the basket, I kind of went grabbing for other similarly shaped items. I know you guys had said before that you don't like, ooh, when I kind of pick through the ones that I get. So I didn't do that. Or not pick through, but pre-open. So I didn't, but I wanted to, <gasps> it flipped right out. It fell right out of you guys. There's like no glue at all. It's kind of a bummer. Let's see. At least I didn't need to lose. Oh yeah, it's held together by like a thin film of like nothingness. I can see that. So this will have to get re-glued. The pan's okay. So I'll show you guys like that and stayed. It's pretty. Um, I'll definitely have to fix that. Ooh, this is very, it's a very wet shadow. It's very pink. Let's see how we're going to do this. How are we doing this? It's pretty colorful. It is very wet. What do you think, you guys? That's just a very light pass. I think I could actually get some, something done with this. This is very pretty. Um... Although how it says made in the USA. And somebody made a really good point that said, you know, no matter how good it looks, if it's coming from, from Wish or I guess Joom, it's not going to be real. Um, uh, I believe it. I, I don't know that uh, any of this stuff is actually authentic now that I think about it. But it is a pretty color. Hopefully um, I can 
get some of use out of it. There were, these were actually $2. So these are, I definitely don't believe that they are authentic. The ones on the Wish site just did have me fooled because they were $5 or $4 and they were basically like a, a dollar or something cheaper than the originals. So I thought maybe they were just like discontinued or something or misprinted like the Kathleen Zeitz when it was Catherine Lights or something. I don't remember. It was a long time ago. A long time ago in YouTube years. So, okay. This seems weird. What is, uh, what is? So this is why I do this because it's so funny. So I went through, this is like a blinds to clean your blinds because we do have blinds at our house and they're the vertical variety. Horizontal, I lied, the horizontal variety. And um, I'm pretty sure that's why I bought this, is because it spaces out. I just think it's funny. I'll open it up in a second. But it's like got a tie on the side. So it's funny. So it's like, it's like a present. Happy birthday. Clean some stuff. Right? It's just what I always wanted. This does not move very much. And they're all connected, which is kind of weird. It's like a very weird looking E or an alligator. It's an alligator. Anywho, it's got a brush on this side. Corny jokes notwithstanding, I think it will actually do a good job. They are very narrow, so our blinds are kind of wider. Um, we'll see how it works. This comes off, it feels like, for, for some reason. I always forget you guys can't see what's going on down here. But, um, let's see. What the heck was that? Did I or did I not just pull this out of this? And inside were these earrings. That's gotta be, because this is so big that it wouldn't have fit in any of the smaller ones. Okay, um, so let's try these on then, shall we? I thought I got these in two different sizes. I could again be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure these are rhinestone hoops because you can never have too much sparkle in your life. These go all the way around. Um, I have a pair, they are very chunky. Why, not focusing camera, hello? Hi, easy phone home. So they are very chunky and I don't like them. I think these might be actually a little bit bigger circumference. Ah, uh, yeah, these are a little big. Um, so I don't know. So a fun fact about my ears, not really fun fact, but I'll show you anyway. Um, maybe interesting fact. They, my ears were pierced when I was two weeks old. Um, by my godmother, God rest her soul, and she did them with a needle and thread while I was nursing. Uh, that kind of hopefully explains the reason why my e earrings go like that. So they, this one always goes this way because the hole is that way, and this one kind of sits the other way, which is I remember now why I don't ever wear um, hoops because I look like that. And that's not how it's supposed to look. They're supposed to look like that. And I could get them re-pierced, re I guess, but uh, my ear, <laughs> oh, what's it, ear holes, um, they never close, no matter what. Like, I've gone years without wearing earrings. Um, I know it's so hard to imagine, but um, they don't close. So for me to get them re-pierced, I'd probably, I don't even know how that would work. My brother's actually a tattoo artist, and he does piercing, so I could probably ask him. But I kind of feel like, Kind of takes away from, I don't know, the story. Is that weird? Am I too, um, what's the word? Not nostalgic. I can't think of the word. What is the word? I keep wanting to say symptomatic. That's not like too, I don't know. I'll figure it out. I'll put it in the comments or in the little caption thing. Um, sentimental. Uh, there you go. Um, God, if anybody took screen grabs of this to see how ridiculous the expressions are in my face, I would have been mortified. So, how did we get to 15 minutes already? But, alright, what is this? Another one of these, buy our t-shirts, because we're weird. So buy a t-shirt. Design your own t-shirt. Why does this have anything to do with t-shirts? I don't know. These are like the classy items. And more earrings. Look at that. Would you look at that? And they, they're very, um, it's funny because with Wish, 
you don't real you know that they're earrings because the posts are poking out of the package. I guess the design your own t-shirt thing covers them up. So okay, I'm rambling yet again. So these are cute. These are two um, kind of dynasty style um, corporate marca. I don't know what these are. They're just dainty um, earrings. Maybe I can show you guys sometime today. Okay. So they're um, pearl and they're little X's. I thought they're cute. They come with backs, obviously. Um, we're going to try them. Are we going to try them? We're going to try them. Okay. So I figured, like, if I ever need to wear something pearl, I think I might have been in a little bit of a pearl phase. I think I mentioned that last a couple hauls ago as well. They're not terrible. They're kind of cute. They're more mature. They look more mature when I put these on. Um, I don't know. I guess they look okay. What are you going to do? Sometimes you just need to wear pearls. Although I can't think of a time where you need to wear pearls, but maybe sometimes you need to wear pearls. I don't know. I think they're cute. They may be a little matronly, but you know, who's to say? Who's to say this isn't somebody's style? Who's to say it's not mine? Who's to say this camera will ever focus? Ooh, look at that. Okay, now it finally did. All right, so third pair of earrings down, and three packages to go. Ooh, let me get this one. This is long. Let's see. I seriously just tried to open this with this. So I may need a bigger table. We'll see. Customs declaration. What do you have to declare customs? Oh, customs. Ooh, this is, I have to say the wrapping is much more, um, feels much more secure. Ooh, these are colors. These are lipsticks, I think. Um, these are beep, 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 beep. So they do care for free shipping too. Imagine that. Imagine that wish. These are all the color pop. Ooh, ultra matte lips. I don't even remember buying these, but I will. I'm okay with that. Um, made in the USA. Doubtful. This says Tool, and then Avenue. So four and twelve. Why am I getting so close? They're pretty. I like the hollow. Hello everyone. I've just recently started watching that Simply Neological gal. She's fantastic. I love her. Um, so these are matte lip, ultra matte lips. Um, why won't you open? Okay. I'm just dreading like these color, Oh. Don't you hate when you get stuff? And I know it's normal, but like it's all cracky on the inside. I don't remember ordering this color at all. Why would I want this color? I have no lips. So that's going to someone. That looks kind of dry. I should probably open it anyway. But let me show you what I'm doing. Sorry, guys. So this is like a weird random rose color. Let the swatching continue, ladies and gentlemen. Lips. Oh, that's like a bricky, kind of a brick red. That's not bad. Um, I may actually wear that. What do you think? What do you think? Maybe? It's pretty. I don't know which one this one is. Tool. Uh, sure, number 12. Gotta like it. Um, the last time I tried on a ColourPop matte anything, it was on for a while. Um, okay, I fixed the little problem that we had with the crack. This, however, is very, very red avenue. I don't know what avenue you're working on. I mean, I didn't mean to go like that. You know what I mean. So there's the red. It's a very bold red. Um, I actually may have picked this. I don't remember doing that because it looked to be not orange. But it does seem to look a little, it reads orange a little on camera. But it ain't. Nope, nope, nope. I like it. I don't know when I'd wear it again, but we can try. Maybe I'll wear it for a video and you guys can laugh because I look like the Joker. It is possible. Oh, that doesn't sound good. When you open a package that came all the way from China, it goes, can you hear that? Makes you worry. Okay. 
Uh, don't, I'm holding, not holding my breath for this one, guys. What is this? It's a hook. What the heck the it's for? Oh, you know what? So when I bought this, it's just a hook, a 3M hook for like your coats. When I bought this, it was for me, um, for work. I was going to stick it to my cube. We have since moved offices. And they gave me a double wide, I call it. It's like a larger cube, like a supervisor one. Because uh, that is one. I supervise my domain. And um, they gave us hooks. But I actually like mine better, so we'll see what happens. Anyway, it's a 3M backing, thicker, black plastic. Kind of, I must have been just really trying to accomplish some some goals, some personal goals there when I was trying to get this. I'm like, this feels like a donut. So I thought it was a squishy, but it's not. It's a weird thing of hair. Well, it looks delightful and delicious. It's not. So, oh, this is really weird. Why, why do I want this? What? Oh, that's so weird. It's a hair thing. Tell me this doesn't look like a chocolate donut. It looks like, ah, uh, no. So this, I'm guessing, oh, that's so random. You put it like, it kind of matches my hair too. So I could, I could do this, maybe. It's not like you guys can see this anyway, but. Oh, that's weird. I don't know how they would do that. I would have to like scrunchy it. Did I seriously just say that? I would have to like elastic it. What am I even talking about? Because it's not like you can do it twice. I'll have to, I'll have to find the listing. This is just, that was weird. Because I can't, I literally couldn't do this twice. It would have to like shrink back. Okay, well, I don't know. We'll have to figure out what this is for. Anybody know what this is really for? I'm thinking it was maybe ballerina bun kind of thing, but I just lost one of my pretty earth, face earrings. Um. I don't know guys. I'm going crazy. What is this? Did I not open this already? I did not open this already. That was, oh yeah. So I don't know how long I was rambling before um, I realized it got cut off because I really need to set a timer because I yap yap yap. Okay. So this is the last thing. I did not open it. I, <coughs> excuse me. I'm gonna go do this. I always do one too many things, I think, or talk one too many minutes, 10 too many minutes. What is all this? Oh, okay. So, do you remember the ladle that I bought from Wish? I thought, and well, it came from Wish, but I thought I'd ordered it from Joom. That's because this is the one I ordered from Joom. And this is actually way nicer. It's a dinosaur. <laughs> Isn't that cute? I like it. He's my friend. He's like the good dinosaur, whatever his name was. So he actually has feet instead of like that weird little tray. Um, he is going to sit on a flat surface. Oh, please. He is going to sit on... Things are flying everywhere. On a flat, flat surface. On a flat surface, take like seven, maybe, and be there when you need to ladle something. Because I know that's important. Ladling is a common thing that is overlooked in life. You have soup. You need a spoon. And before you eat it with a spoon, you need a ladle. Mine has jumped. Uh, mine just committed suicide, apparently. Jumped off a cliff. And I got color all over my pants. So, in uh, summation, don't let your dinosaur ladles take short, lower long walks off of short clips, and I will see you guys another time. Thanks so much for watching. Burn me out. Bye.